Welcome, I'm glad you could join me for another run in Revenant. Now, having killed the Solifuge, let's head back to town and talk to some people. You seem to grow more powerful every time I see you. It is a miracle you have survived as long as you have. I suppose Sardok was right about you. Thank you, Lord Tendrick. I will not disappoint you. Come on. Welcome back, Locke. How goes your quest? It was a long, hard trek to Eastern Aquilon. Now that I have arrived there, I feel confident your daughter will be home safely in short order. That is good to hear. I apologize that it was necessary to go through all of that. Unfortunately, it was the only way you could recapture your combat skills. I understand. The time was not wasted. Perhaps you should visit the shops. We had a shipment of supplies come in while you were gone. I think there's one more piece of information that we can drag out of Sardok. I apologize. Unfor yep. Sardok, what do you know about the ancient queen? What? Uh, uh, I do not see how that has anything to do with your quest. I realize that. But in the caves I saw... Never mind that. It is unimportant. I am ready to head back to the ruins now. Goodbye, wizard. I guess we are stepping on some toes there. Right, let's uh, uh, let's talk to some other people. I have prayed to the gods, and they have bid me to accept you into my heart. You sure are big on those gods, are you not? You have risen from hell through the forgiveness of the gods. You were given the opportunity to save Mist Haven, to amend your past sins. Save us, and you shall be forgiven. Look, lady, I do not know what kind of half-baked religion you subscribe to, but you are preaching to the wrong guy. All I know of gods and their minions is what little I remember of hell. And as far as I can recall, the experiences were not particularly pleasant. Yeah, I guess asking a revenant about religion isn't a uh, very good idea. You seem to have learned much. I will now teach you a new technique. Oh, it's starting to get uh, a bit longer in terms of chains. Well, it's called a puma chain, so I guess. <laughs> I wonder how that'll work out in the wild. I hear you have been through the caves. You must have seen the Queen's Shrine. You must tell me about it. I will tell you all I have seen in due time. Right now, I need some information on the ruins. A bit of history is all I can offer you. The great empire that once existed on this island was destroyed thousands of years ago. The crater in the center of the island was once their capital. But now, the ruins on the eastern side of the island are all that remains. Many believe that a huge network of dungeons was constructed underneath these ruins. Of course, I can't confirm any of this as fact because well, no one who has set out to explore them has returned. That does not sound very encouraging. 
I'm afraid it doesn't. We have a saying about those ruins around here. What is that? People go in, but they don't come out. Is that supposed to make me feel better about it? Well, I... They will have to send me back to hell before I go down. I have got a bone to pick with those priests. So I have no idea what to expect. Uh, unfortunately, no. Well, I guess I would not have it any other way. Interesting. I demand a full report when you return. As soon as Yagoro is defeated, I will give you enough information to fill a hundred history books. Deal? Deal. Alright, let's save that for Revenant 2. The filling of the bookshelves. And a new weapon that would do nicely, I think. Actually, before I get a new weapon, let me just check how much damage this thing was. The Ranger Sword 65. Alright. I see you've been putting my weapon to good use. No. It's not your weapon, it's something I picked up. Show me what you have available. Now then, what have we? Hey, Claymore, 73 damage. Yes, please. As you wish. And where did that go? Oh, of course, in the equipment bag. So what's a Claymore do then? A huge sword made famous by the Highlanders of the Northlands. Ah, a fitting weapon. Its size alone is enough to strike fear into the hearts of your foes. Fine, that'll do nicely. Let's sell some of the rubbish I've got. Yeah, soul cleaver, blackened axe, broadsword, and a ranger sword. Ah. Okay, let's head on. Oh, and let's close the bag. Well, welcome back, Locke. How goes business, Rubold? A trade ship was here yesterday. The sailors nearly drank all the ale I had. Fortunately, they spent enough to tide me over until you take care of our problem for us. You are going to take care of the problem, aren't you? Mm, why should I? I am doing my best. Well, do you think that'll be enough? It is going to have to be. Be assured that I will not rest until every member of the cult is killed. Alright, let's also speak to the dancer. Let's she let's see whether she remembers us. Hmm. Back again, huh? You know something? You look like you've gotten stronger. Those muscles make me wanna melt. I do not suppose you have anything useful to tell me. A trade ship just left port yesterday. The shops probably have a bunch of new stuff. Thank you for your help. Sure. Anytime. Yeah, no, she doesn't have anything useful to say at all. Ever. How's it going with the treasure hunt? I am hunting priests and creatures, not treasure. Hmm. Well, have you cleaned out the caves? If there's no more danger there, I could go and grab some of whatever you left behind. I would not say the caves are free of danger. Besides, you would have to deal with the Agrok to even get in there. Damn! I forgot about the Agrok! Look, since you made it through once, would you mind going back and get me some treasures? You cannot be serious. Well, well, well I figured it was worth a try. You know. Seriously, I'm everybody's bitch in this town. Ah, let's talk to our old friend, the drunk. Hey, how's it going, Lucky? You seem to be in better spirits. Indeed I am. I'm over to break up, and I'm doing better. Now that I got my ring back. Good. I hear you've made it to the eastern side of the island. Rumor has it that the main base of the Yagoro cult is located in the ruins. So I have heard. 
Just be careful out there. Get the girl and get out. I'd hate to see anything happen to you. For my sake? Or Mist Haven's? Oh, I guess a little of both. You came through for me in a time of need. I've no reason to believe you won't do the same for our town. Though I was compelled to start this quest, I would not abandon it now if I could. Ah, it seems the blood is finally flowing through your veins again. Good luck, my friend. Yeah, I think that's not for some kind of feeling towards Misthaven. We are just pissed off at the cult that they're fighting back. So, they gotta die. Well, let's actually go and do that right now. Alright, now that we're back here again, let's enter into the ruins and murder everything we can find. This is the eastern side of the island. And there's a whole bunch of... Um, forestry forest kind of uh, there's a whole bunch of forest surrounding this area but it's mostly uninteresting this is the most interesting part really <laughs> and then you enter the ruins greetings stranger stranger you don't presume to tell me you have never heard of the great Navarro Alsace nope no but I assume you have heard of the Great Lock de Avarum. Ah, the Great, uh, no. I am the greatest sorcerer this world has ever known. I suppose you have come here to seek my expertise. Actually, I am here to destroy the Yagoro cult. Ah, yes, a bothersome bunch they are. A powerful sorcerer would serve you well in your quest. Do you know where I might find one? Hmm, it depends. How much gold are you offering for my services? I offer you nothing but the thrill of combat and adventure. Well, let's see. Taking on the cult sounds fairly dangerous. Perhaps under less threatening circumstances, I would join you. But as the greatest sorcerer in Ur, it would be too great a loss to this world if something was to happen to me. Yeah, right. We shall meet again, warrior. I can hardly wait. God, that was a pissing contest. I love these conversation pieces. As you might already uh, deduce, that's another one of those characters that was supposed to be able to join you and that you can play in the multiplayer. Ah, let's just throw this at them. I've learned the fireball spell. To my enjoyment. It's basically the same kind of damage dealing spell as the lightning bolt. Except with the difference that it's an actual AoE. And that it has a knockback effect. Come on, all of you, die. Oh, Jesus. Stop, stop hiding behind the architecture and stop spawning creatures. These aren't all that threatening anymore right now. Yeesh. That also doesn't do that much damage. It's just, eh. It's instinctual to want to avoid damage. I mean, it's, I think, about 60 damage or something like that, but you get stunned for a short second and you stand there. Also, you look stupid. What's in here? A root. I think that is... is that... Where did that go then? Hey. Ah, why in this bag? Really? In the bag of bags? Oh, well. It's not a uh, it's not a key, but well, sort of a key. It's a quest item. Nope, I'm not gonna fight you. Goodbye. 
Oh, zombies. I'll do them. Oh, wait, of course, the new... Uh, oh, I haven't got any fatigue. But the new attack. Wouldn't mind trying that out. Empty vial. Yes, yeah, so you have to collect a whole bunch of stuff throughout this level and then at the end use it to unlock the gate, the, uh, the exit gate. Now you can't use the combo attack if you're fatigued. Otherwise it makes for a, a nice running attack, I think. Let me just get some mana. Oh shit. These have a lot of defense. So I don't mind using spells on them. Oh shit, I think I'm stuck. Nope. No, 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 what the hell? Just at least manage to throw a fireball in the right direction, dude. I think the good thing about the combo is that you can use it and um, it interrupts the enemy. So you can almost fully pull it off, almost, every time. As long as you have enough fatigue. Um, I haven't got any mana, I've got low health. Let's just... Jesus. Yeah, that should do it. Yeah, fire everywhere. 1,500 health or so is a lot for one creature. A blue flower. Is everything... Is all of... Yeah, all of those are just getting stacked in here. Those are entered into vials, and that also means we have to collect a number of vials, so that all the items we collect, we can fit into a vial. Hey, why can't I... Jesus. Vampire's hitting me with his stick. Ah, screw this. Yeah, sometimes it's a bit lazy to just spam fireballs, but... It gets the job done. And another empty vial. And sometimes that attack just totally misses the target. Yeesh. Uh, let me just heal up for a second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The new attack is not a good idea against zombies. The old strategy of uh, hit and retreat is still the best thing against zombies. And this is a tiny maze. Luckily. Ah, Jesus. I don't want to use so many... Damn, come on, dude. I don't want to use so many potions, but... Sometimes enemies just deal a lot of damage. And a lockpicking chest. Oh, I'd hoped for more of the items. A water vial. That's undoubtedly going to become useful. Anything else here? Damn, that's a lot of zombies. 
Ooh! I didn't know it had that much range. Um. Why didn't that work? Oh well. A Valkyrie sword. Now let's see how much damage does the current sword do? Uh, 73. Then we have the Valkyrie sword. 75. Hooray, an upgrade! <laughs> Alright, so I'm back here again, had to restart the game and redo this piece of the area, actually. I don't save very often, mostly because I don't expect the game to crash. Anyway, we are back with the Valkyrie Sword. Right? Yeah, Valkyrie Sword. Cool, let's get out of this maze then. Zombies aren't all that dangerous, but sometimes when they are biting you, they can just pull off some really nasty combos. Also, I think the regeneration spell just isn't cutting it anymore, but uh, sometimes I'm just too lazy to use a better uh, healing spell. Alright, what's this then? A graveyard. Ah, a new type of enemy. A caster. Holy shit, that's a lot. Oh, if they're so bunched up. Um, yeah. Dang, 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 dang. Yeah, that should do nicely. Oh, lovely. Come on, the last one. Yep. And time to loot. As you might have seen, I've started putting points in agility. Um, way earlier I said that agility is pretty much useless because it only works for hand-to-hand -hand combat, but what the guide actually meant was, well, close quarter combat. So it just works on everything that involves weapons and that is very important. In case you want to hit something and not just deal glancing blows all the damn time, you're going to have to put a few points in agility. A lot of it uh, depends on your level, but agility helps quite a bit. So, that's what we're going to put a few points in from now on. Especially because enemies are getting increasingly difficult to kill. With 180 defense against my pitiful offense. On the other hand, it gives me an excuse to use spells. So I don't really mind. Especially if you've got an AoE spell ready and they're all bunching up. Yeah, sure. Perhaps a wee bit expensive in terms of mana there. And a Sathi Claw. All of this is... Yep, all of that is rubbish. That's supposed to go... Uh, well, together with these at the end of this level into some slots. Oh, it's a summon to Sathias. Thought there's a dragon or something uh, behind the pillar. Is he still invisible? Well, alright, I'll let you live. Shouldn't have come after me, old man. Now oh, more of these. Yeah, let's just use one of these. Yeah, 
Ah, what's in here then? Yeah, oh, not one of the essential items. Oh well, we'll get everything. An acid vial. That is one of the items we needed. Alright, we haven't explored this area yet, I think. Let's see what's over here. Ah, oh, another empty vial. That's the chest we could see from the other side. Just a moment ago. God, Fireball is an invaluable spell. Lovely. And a new attack works fine as well. Jesus. <laughs> an entire set of armor. Let's see whether that's worth its salt. Uh, protection 4 offers additional resistance to poison. This suit of armor is a remnant from the days of the ancient empire, highly stylized and adorned in red and black. Alright, so, uh, I've recovered from the crash again. I don't know why the game is doing it right now, but let's hope it doesn't continue to do so. I'm probably going to save a few more times this time instead of just forgetting about it and then finding uh, out I forgot it. Well, usually I don't need to reload. Oh, come on. Just blow it up. A bone. Yeah, Alright. Hmm. I didn't know the lightning damaged them for that much. Yeah, but it's got a hit, of course. That's a bit of a problem. At least with the fireball, you've got an AoE. It's cute that they uh, put in some traps. <laughs> Good God. I keep trying to pull the uh, new combo off, and uh, more often than not, it puts me in harm's way. A Ring of the Arcane. Uh, what is that, then? A ring called forth from another realm by the sorcerers of the ancient empire. Adds to mana and increases spell damage. How much mana? Uh, 770... Alright, it adds less mana than the other ring, but if it adds to spell damage, yeah, why not? Is that invoke skill? No, it's probably just something we can't see. Oh, curious how much it's gonna do. And what is this? An empty vial. I think that was the last empty vial we needed. Yes, to put a bone in. Alright. And now we have all those things. Cool. Let me just quickly save here before uh, things go bad again. No, don't go invisible. Don't go invisible. Just die. Ah. I think this is it, but was there something else on the other side? Just let me quickly explore. I don't think so, but... Yeet! Yeah, there was nothing there. <laughs> Alright, let's solve this puzzle then. Ah, uh, a sausage as a clue? No. Alright, a gate portal scroll. And what does it say? 
Before you lies the sealed portal of darkness, six rare elements of Aquilon must be recovered from these ruins and sacrificed to the ancient spirits before access will be granted. No, I don't need to place them in any specific order. Just... Wherever? Uh, let's give that a try then. Yep, just wherever. Well, that shouldn't be too difficult. And the portal opens. Alright. Let's see what we meet here. A zombie. Nothing else, really. Uh, fighting on stairs is really tough. The game doesn't handle vertical geometry that well. Oh, a white dragon again. And I need to really... Yep. Use my mana quick bar key. Uh, oh, lucky me. Hmm, not so lucky. I think lightning deals more damage to him. Oh, that just teleports me inside. Can we just finish that? Yeah, alright. I'm not gonna run from a fight. Come here, come here. Where are you? Yeah. Ah, uh, it's so cute when you do a combo straight into nothingness. Have I even got something? Yeah, I've got... Another level up. You just keep leveling up. But you've leveled... Ah, nice, another point in agility. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. Usually it says uh, where the point goes. Not this time. Okay. Uh, I think that's it for this episode, then. So, join me next time for traversing... the pit. <laughs>